My name is Shan Duotang. I am the fourth generation of the founder of Guanlin Paper Cutting. The Guanlin Paper Cutting has been listed in the catalog of nationally protected non-material cultural heritage. I am 62 years old. I began to learn this skill when I was eight. With simple tools, Guanlin Paper Cutting requires depth skills, experience, and diligence. With bright colors, vivid models, delicate lines, dynamic forms of expression, and skillful engraving, it was regarded as a unique Chinese folk art and was added to the list of World Intangible Cultural Heritage by UNESCO in 2009. There are 38 processes involved in making paper cuts. It's a pure handicraft that cannot be replaced by modern machines. But as more and more young people leave Guangling to find work, it's an art that is slowly dying. However, Zhang has decided to do something about it. We organize our family members, brothers and sisters, trying to explore new ways to revive this traditional skill. In 1999, with the support of the local government, Zhang began to promote Guangling paper cutting. He hired many paper cutting artists and they started produce according to market demands. Meanwhile, with the help of computer design, there is now more content available. What you see is the paper cutting work of the Yungang grottles. Workers make carvings according to computer designs, then it undergoes the process of dyeing, attaching layers, and so on. Most of us think paper cutting is flat. Gradually, we notice it does have a stereo feeling effect, and it can also have better perspectivity. Besides keeping up with the market demand, Zhang Duotang has also improved his production techniques. Now their paper cutting depict cultural relics, scenic spots, characters, and famous paintings. Other products include stamps, scroll paintings, and picture frames. In 2007, Zhang began to build the Guangling Paper Cutting Cultural Industry Park, investing more than 45 million yuan or 6.7 million US dollars into the project. He also built China's first Guangling Paper Cutting Art Museum and a vocational training school setting up a paper-cutting industry chain in the process. It attracts half a million visitors every year, and he exports products worth more than 1.5 million U.S. dollars. More people have joined his team since the establishment of the industry park. This is how many villagers in the Guangling County are now making their living. 36-year-old Li Hailing is one of them. She says she can earn more money than before and her life and health are improving. I like paper cutting because we have many windows in our village. Paper cuts are good window decorations. The flowers we make are like real flowers and I enjoy doing this. So far, the Guangling paper cutting products include more than 50 series and over 8,000 varieties. The brand has won worldwide recognition and allows people to learn more about Chinese culture and the ingenuity of its people. <laughs>